Well, it's time to keep them honest. Here is Andy Campbell, who kind of looks like Vince Vaughn oh. early on, in the early stages. In the early stages. When he was young and thin and in fighting shape. so sweet. The Thank swinger. Swing, swingers. And okay. Swingers. <laughs> Not sure what that's in. All right, welcome to Keeping Them Honest. Uh, who are we keeping honest today? Japan. Yes, Japan, the land of the rising sun. The nation that spends its time eating raw fish, playing Nintendo, and fighting Godzilla. We're talking about Japan today because of Valentine's Day. Now, yesterday when I was scouring the internet for worst Valentine's Day gift, I missed perhaps the strangest. You just might have been the recipient yesterday of a gift certificate to a Japanese spa that offers chocolate baths. Oh, no. That's right, ladies. Those who just can't get enough of the sweet stuff can immerse themselves in water mixed with cocoa and fragrant, fragrant bath powders. Twice a day, the staff pours creamy chocolate over the bathers, who wow. smear it on their bodies and then lick it off. Yeah. Wow, this sounds like a DVD I rented from the back of the video store last week called <laughs> Charlie Does the Chocolate Factory. Oh. Yeah, it stars Johnny Deep. Oh. My favorite part are those adorable Humpa Lumpas. Oh. Right, Mitch? Any, any chance to do a midget porn joke, I'm in there. All right. Anyway, the spa claims that modern research shows chocolate helps release feel-good hormones in the body, which trigger reactions that mimic the feelings associated with being in love. Being dipped in it also makes you feel like this guy. My dad's sister recently went in for this treatment, and now she's a chocolate-covered ant. Did you, did you catch it? Did you catch it? Folks! Pow! That's comedy right there. Ah, I know. Uh, I, I, I want to know, why is it always about the chocolate? You ever notice that? It's always about chocolate. What about those of us who want to be dipped in the creamy nougat? Always a bridesmaid. The Japanese spa resort offers dozens of other amusement baths, including a wine bath, a coffee bath, and a sake, sake bath. In the past, it has even offered a curry dip. Yeah, they figure the smell of curry usually forces people to take a bath anyway, so why not just combine the two? Personally, I'm waiting for them to come out with the Colt 45 bath. Because, honey, that stuff works every time. I'm Andy Campbell, back to those bathers at the big kid's desk.